Repair Clinic makes fixing things easy. With millions of replacement parts available on our website and the help you need to do the repair yourself. Since we encourage you to perform this repair safely, a warning icon will appear when you should use caution. Before you replace the dishwasher control board, be sure to turn off the power to the appliance. Use a T15 Torx bit to unthread the four screws, securing the custom outer door panel to the metal door panel. The screws are located at the top corners and second from the bottom on the left and right sides. Lift the custom outer panel up to fully detach and set it aside. Next, unthread the remaining screws, securing the metal door panel to the inner panel. Remove the retaining pin. Now pull the door panel forward and lift up to remove. Unthread the door latch mounting screws. You can now lift the control panel off and disconnect the touchpad wire harness from the control board to fully remove. Use a flathead screwdriver to release the locking tab, then slide the control board housing to the left to detach. Remove the small wire cover. Release the long wire cover tabs and rotate the cover to detach. Note the orientation of the wire connectors, then disconnect them from the old board. Install the new control board by first connecting the wire connectors to the appropriate terminals. Align the long wire cover and snap it into place. Do the same for the small wire cover. Now insert the control board housing tabs into the slots in the mounting bracket and slide the housing to the right to secure. Reinstall the control panel by first connecting the touchpad wire harness to the new board. Align the panel and rethread the door latch mounting screws to secure. Reinstall the outer metal door panel by sliding it over the mounting tabs and aligning it with the inner panel. Insert the retaining pin to help hold the panel in place. Rethread the screws to secure. Reinstall the custom outer panel by inserting the mounting studs into the keyhole slots. Slide the panel down until the top of the custom panel is flush with the top of the control panel. Replace the four screws to secure the panel. With the repair completed, turn the power supply back on and your dishwasher should be ready for use.
At Repair Clinic, we make fixing things easy. Thank you for supporting the production of these videos by purchasing your parts from our website.